I'm Alex Peak, and uh, I'm the, one of the founders of Primer Labs, and we make a game called Code Hero. Code Hero is a video game that teaches you how to make video games. And it teaches you how to do this with a code gun that shoots code with JavaScript. And when it hits the target, it does something called eval, which executes the code that you've written. But you don't have to write code, so if you can't type, you can just copy paste. So you point at code in the environment, and it tells you what the code does, and you click. And it pulls it in 3D into your code gun. And then you can switch between all the code you found instead of blocks or making portals. So with Code Hero, the story is giving you a reason. You have to do this because there's an, well, I won't say, there's an AI, and the AI has an agenda. And uh, if you don't understand code, you won't have much say in that agenda. So the story drives you to master code. But it drives you specifically not just to play the game for its own sake, to make something. So if you're going to beat the game, you have to not just beat the challenges in the game, you have to beat the challenge outside of the game, which is working on a game continuously, not getting sidetracked, not getting shy about showing it to people, and to ship it. Um, and we just shipped our game, Code Hero, after working on this since January. And it's pretty exciting because you work on a game day in, day out for a long time, and it takes a lot of dedication to finish it. And so what we've done with Code Hero is design a game to help other people finish their games too. Because a lot of people will give up. And so the story of the game actually has you go into the world where you're going to learn programming and then actually give you the feedback and encouragement to follow through. So you can get Code Hero by joining the beta at codehero.org or at primerlabs.com. And if you sign up, once you are accepted, you'll receive a copy of Code Hero and your orders to be able to help with changing the world and learning code. And your teacher in the game is Ada Lovelace. Ada Lovelace invented programming in 1862, and Grace Hopper invented programming languages when she was in the Navy. Most people don't know programming was invented by two women, um, but she helps you. And the fundamental thing that you do, by which is shoot the code gun at the target, is the way you explore Unity 3D programming. So if you are already doing Unity 3D programming, or if you're doing another engine, um, you already know that basically you can learn just about anything just by playing with it. But we encourage the player to think that way if they haven't tried it. By well, here's the code, it says move down. And here it is, hit object.transform.position.y minus equals four. And you might be thinking, oh, I don't know what that does, but you already do. It moves things down. And that's all you need to know. So you click copy, you aim at the target, and you click, and it moves down. But if you hit the editor, you can change minus four to plus four by editing it, just like that. And now, it goes back up. So this is a game where you're able to program and you're never going to get stuck, you're never going to get lost, you're not going to hit that stumbling block. Um, we think that the goal should be code literacy. So we're going to make the game as free as possible to as many people as possible so that everyone gets a chance to learn programming. And we believe that in the future we're going to have a world where game programming is going to be a fundamental art as much as reading and writing is. If you have an idea for a game, you can make it. And your game can not only be a thing that's cool and fun and is like something you've imagined, but it can change the whole world. And that's the kind of games we're encouraging our players to make. Um, if I would say one thing to someone who's thinking about making their first game, it is that when you think about John Carmack and you think about Tim Sweeney and you think about Joachim Anti who made the Unity engine, remember Joachim Anti was a teenager when he made it. All right? You look at the pictures of John Carmack when he made Wolfenstein. He's like an adorable kid. He, he still kind of looks the same. He never ages. It's kind of weird. But these guys are just like you. So if you want to become a code hero, go for it. Make something. You could be the next big changer of the world who inspires someone else to make their game too. So that's Code Hero.